Denmark. Sears Guild. Mustard Gardens. I'm glad you can say these names. Yeah, yeah. Just making it up. I've been up all night, friends. <laughs> Say a big welcome to somebody in Denmark and Chuby if you're watching from Lingby in Denmark. Chuby who won the first of the FEI TV competitions, Facebook competition. Got yourself a free annual subscription to FEI TV and there will be more sort of competitions for the HSBC FEI European Championships with Leo and Mullen next week and also for the FEI European Show Jumping Championships. Look out for them on feitv.org or on the FEI TV Facebook. So congratulations and welcome to Anne Shubai from Lingby in Denmark. Now back to the business here in the arena. 69.970. Elizabeth got in the team event. Really nice massage here. I like this massage. It's got height. It's got mostly got there a couple of moments, but really generally really good regularity. Superb transitions. Very uphill horse. A little bit tense again in the mouth, just against the hand, but more concentration than irritation. But lovely uh, suspension point in in this uh, massage. And the moment when the horse holds itself when it's above the ground. Lovely transitions as well. Really easy. The horse looks like it's well within its coat. Uh, scope rather to, to do the half bars a bit more quality in the trunk will be better a nice bend nice direction again a very good transition into I think a fairly high scoring massage cutting the corner a bit there it's like cheat a bit of swinging side to side after the corner as well which the judges behind are going to notice down a bit more in the extension, but good ground cover, good power. I really like this massage, it's, it's got the height, it's got the quality. It's going to be interesting how the horse transitions from this higher massage into the Piaf, which we'll see shortly. But this is better straight into a, 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 where the horse relaxes out, reaches for the hand. Tiny bit more effect, which is now coming a couple of strides into it. So we go. It's sort of lifting a little bit there, just the contact getting lost from the rider. That's a shame because the beginning was nice. Now we have the collection into the PF. But it's not this PF, though. I think this pulls will probably do this quite nicely, but it's the PF massage. I'm really interested to see how the horse comes with that. A bit unsettled. Bad transition, a little high in the neck and too much forwards. But diagonal steps and just hollowing slightly on the piano. But if what she did cheat a little, she's climbed forwards a bit. Yeah, quite a, a free massage, not so hot in the beginning. That's that's what I mean. Yeah, because that much massage, it, it just makes it a little harder when they massage that high sometimes to get in. If you can't have a almost a collected then an extended massage, you need to adjust those massages and then they let you into the PF. But it, it's often the case. And now the massage is not as good as before the counter strike off. It's an obedient strike off, but it wasn't. The horse has just come a little hollow and tense. You need to get it relaxed quickly. We're still on very good marks. She's running at the moment. Running at about 70%. Just missed out on that 70 cent barrier point zero three below it. Yeah. Team competition. The horse has a good uphill look, and the second half of that uh, half pass was really quite well. a little tense on the change to the left, but she's managed it well. She got a good change here. Again, tension bounced a little bit upwards, didn't really climb through. And the necks just come up a little bit against her. She's got to try and recover it really quickly. And there's little time in this test to do that. Two nice changes, swinging a bit behind. A good quality falls to get the height. I think she's struggling a little bit with the frame, you know. Just enlarge on that. Well, okay. the horse has come, if you look at the shape, you know, you've got the neck in carriage, and I think the bottom of this horse's neck 
it's just come up against her a little bit. But she's got it back now. There's better now into the ones. The horse is done. Now it's climbing up again. Can you see that the neck just at the point is just a little tense. But the nice thing is she's still got good big changes. An average of 7.5 and then 7 on the 1 to be 7.5 on the 2. So not bad marks at all. That's definitely too high in the neck. Good ground cover. I think she's struggling with that horse. I think she's doing well to manage it. Yeah, that's what she needs to do. It's just rounding as she came round the corner. No, that's the neck that's caused that. That horse has gone up against the hand and just fighting out there. And there's no time. You know, you can get lucky, but there's very little time. But she may just get it back better for this right one because the horse will come through. He knows it's going to turn right in the end, so he's going to think a little bit. Not a high quality pirouette. Right? She managed that extremely well for the horse that's got no intents. Okay, transition. A lovely horse. I do like him a lot. He's a real charmer. Absolutely delighted. 